Well, it was a magical morning for Mage and his connections after their Kentucky Derby victory. They welcomed reporters to the back to the barn at Churchill Downs this morning. Our Tyler Griever was there to catch up with them. Yeah, Bobby, any win in the run for the Roses is really special. It is even more special when it's your first victory like for trainer Gustavo Delgado Sr. and his son, assistant trainer Gustavo Delgado Jr. That father son connection makes this as special as it can get. Their champion and mage got to wear the winner's attire this morning at their barn. Delgado Sr. Finally tasted victory in this third try in the Kentucky Derby. Before coming to America, he was a racing legend in his home country of Venezuela. Delgado Jr. says the two of them dreamed of coming over to win this race, so they were asked what it means to get this done together. Don't cry. <laughs> <laughs> you guys would understand the, the, the dynamic of, of them, too. I mean, uh, we, we, we probably saw him, but he's my best friend. My dad. Okay. He accomplished pretty much everything in, 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 in Venezuela. For him, at oh, 60, start over again. For, for me, it's the best example. And can be more proud of him. The Delgado say Mage came out of the race well. If he keeps feeling well, they will run him in the Preakness. But later in Sports Bobby, I'll explain how the family ties extend even beyond the Delgados and what kind of moment this is for their home country of Venezuela.